Alright guys, welcome to the next part. I went ahead and took the liberty of using a human effigy and clearing out the area. Because we are right at the boss door. And also this light emanating from me is, uh, increases my poise. Stamina recovery, this raises my maximum HP, and this decreases the poise of the enemies that I'm attacking. Which actually, I think I might change that for this boss fight. We'll go with increased physical attack. Alright. Let's do it. You might also notice that my weapons are already halfway down. <laughs> Just from clearing out this area. I might just do life gems. Ah, I'm overthinking it. Alright, let's get into it. Very long weapon you have there. Whoa. Where's the next one? Dang it. Figures are gonna have to fight. Ooh, that's that's different. That wasn't too good. It's really hard to learn their pattern when they're both attacking. I probably shouldn't have jumped down. <laughs> This is tough. Oh gosh, I think that's I think that's it. Yep. <laughs> Well, it's, this isn't good. <laughs> Just checking my surroundings. There's no way to get back up.
Well. Was worth a try. So I figured if you hold down circle while climbing up the ladder, it eases your stamina and you climb up it faster. Cool open. They're both gonna jump up here, aren't they? Yep. to oh gosh they're fast <sighs> well here goes a decent chunk of souls I know not just now, but I think I had like 9,000. I feel like that's not going to work out, and I'm just going to keep adding to my deaths. So, there's one option, which is go to other areas, try to get some materials, and maybe... Maybe upgrade my gear. I try to up upgrade my weapons some more. The other option is to use a shield, which I'd rather not do. I want to. I want to try to go as far as I can without it. I think I'm just gonna leave this area alone for now. After all, this is a competition. Otherwise, I would just stay here and just keep on trying. But 
let's go to a new area. Okay, so... There's this one area I found. Um, when I was running through, while I was not recording. Sometimes I just run through these areas just to uh, get the feel of them again and memorize where things are. I did not die though. What I did do is I talked to her to get that item down there, which you can't see anymore because I got it. Which I forgot what it was. I think it was just like a proud soul of the night or something. Something like that. Nothing too important. And then I saw that it opened up into a new area, so I came back and saved it for now. Just speak up if you're in need of miracles. That's what... Now, I'm not sure if it always costs souls, but... She definitely charges us souls, because... Maybe not into miracles, I don't know. I just realized I don't have enough souls. No need. Let's see if I have enough items, maybe. Can you get a thousand more souls? Be right back, guys. All right, we're back. Just speak. Get your souls. Go ahead. May the power. So yeah, this is where that item was. Yeah. What if the abyss is down there? I don't know who you are, but believe me, B. The frailty of the weak disrupts the dark. Leave me alone. Mm. I'm interested in one thing. Dark, and you haven't the gift. But... Leave me alone. Fine. Oh, it's this place. Undead Refuge. Got a new area now, Huntsman's Copes. Undead Refuge, with the guy that doesn't want to talk. <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure you're not dead. But I don't know if I should attack you or not. I can't target you. You're making funny noises. Oh, 
Yeah. They're probably just the enemies for this area. Oh, that one's two hits. I really don't know if I should hit him or not. He's probably not that important, right? Hope not. <laughs> okay, hold on. I just remembered something. Before I go any further... I forgot I was still disconnected from the server. Let me go reconnect real quick. Alright, we're back now. Back online. You respawned, which means you're not important. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? Dark Souls. Butterflies are not innocent. <laughs> Lucky for them. Ah. Have an arrow. get that item. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure out what that thing is. Hmm. I really want to go down there. I see items. Let me go through here and just see what's up. special arrows. Rogue armor. Mm. Sounds like something for me. Jump down or not to jump down. These stairs over there. Bright spot. So it lets in light. It does. Are there any more windows? Let 
me check that rogue armor real quick. I think it'll actually be pretty good if I just upgrade it. It's lighter, which is cool. Oh yeah, I forgot about the ambush. Uh, I can't do that, can I? I would like to do that. Oh, is that just a little fern? something. White, the sneaky place, huh? I don't want this. So many items. Alright, before I go through there, Jump down. No way for me to get back up there is. is there. Oh well. that. I don't know why I did that. What I was going to say was when I'm going really quick, I uh, don't even bother reading the items that I pick up. <laughs> oh, I need a torch. Yeah, probably. It's definitely gonna open or something. an ambush everywhere. Those guys run fast. Gauntlets. Getting the whole set. Jump out the windows. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't switch yet. 
my leather armor for now. <laughs> hmm. That's how you get back up. We're just gonna keep going forward. Of course, it was this way. Okay. What is that noise? Sounds like a drawn bowstring. To jump over or not to jump over. No, I missed. I was there. Uh. Hello? Is, is anyone home? I'm guessing an ambush, maybe? Oh, I'm at the bottom of this place. I should really just... Oh, hey. What is that stuff? So it falls in the water. What is that in the water? What's in the water? <laughs> okay, I did see it look, what looks like a, uh, a hard chest over there. Probably All right, we're we're going to try it. All right. Wait, hold on. So that's a floor? Maybe this isn't a good idea. But Maybe I can see a health bar or something. see someone else is doing the same thing I'm doing. Another phantom.
It's so weird to aim with this. Why wasn't I doing that to begin with? Are there more? Though, so, just in case. It's a ring. Decrease my fall damage. Jump in. Dang it. Decorated rapier said to belong to a prince who appears in an ancient tale. There are variations of the story of the prince who wandered the lands and eventually became undead. The majority of these tales end in tragedy, but there are some exceptions. That one. Probably, oh man, look at the scaling that it does in dexterity, it's an A. That's 80 plus 46, and this was... Alright, I think I'm going to stick with my rapier plus 5 for now. I'll upgrade this, start using that later on. Gotta love my thrusting weapons. Okay, so I don't know if it mattered, but I just walked up to it and pressed X on my uh, PlayStation controller. So I don't know if it's like a hidden prompt or not. This is familiar. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Dark Souls Elevator. Not counting the actual elevator. I knew this door was going to open. I mean, I'm sure. I'm sure everyone did. Hey, you know what this means. Sorry, I just completely trailed off there. <laughs> I thought I was about to fall off and die again. I was going to say we could try to get this again. No. 
<laughs> I didn't know I could ever jump it that much. Well, I think I'm gonna stop it here. I know we didn't get yeah, we didn't get too much done, but we got to a new area, which is cool. Got a got Rickard's rapier and some rogue armor, hollow armor, which I may or may not use. I just thought it sounded cool because it has the word rogue in it. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next part.